Just relax for a second, huh? Hello fam, welcome back to another Gymshark haul video. Both of my lovely assistants decided to join me today. <laughs> this is a very special Gymshark haul video because today we are going over, reviewing, and trying on all my favorite Gymshark pieces. It is officially November and Christmas is just around the corner, so you know what that means. We are doing a Black Friday Gymshark haul video. <laughs> The sale will be starting November 16th at 9 a.m. PST and the entire Gymshark website will be up to 70% off. And if you use my code Allie, you get an extra 10% off on top of the sale. With the entire site being on sale, I honestly was having such a hard time narrowing down what I wanted to show you guys without making this video two hours long. So I narrowed down my favorite pieces, my go-tos, and what I most recommend for you guys to get. Gymshark also added a super cool feature to their app where you can go on and favorite items. So they have a little favorites category and from there you can add everything to your cart and check out. So that way your checkout can be as quick and easy as possible and you can start picking out what things you want to get during the sale. So after you watch this video, make sure you go to the app and heart all your favorite things. So let's get into it, shall we? Starting off with my favorite collection, the Adapt Family. I have to say, this year, I think the Adapt Fleck stole my heart. If you look at my Instagram, I've worn this probably the most out of anything, and I do think it is my top favorite now. We have this beautiful green, blue, this kind of like plum brown color and then of course we have black these also do all come in leggings as well the only legging i have is the green one these are also a fave i'm just a big shorts girl so and with the adapt fleck we probably had some of the most unique tops come out and these were my all-time favorite but these are just so unique these straps that go around your neck and then they kind of just go straight down in the back I feel like it's hard to get a feel for what this looks like when it's off, but once this is on, it's so cute. It shows off the collarbones and the shoulders so well. I'm just obsessed with this top. And then they also came out with this little cropped, kind of like cap sleeve crop t-shirt. But what I also wear with these a lot is this green minimal bra. It matches this green perfectly and i've worn this outfit right here so many times and then also to go with the blue they did a blue bandeau bra and i've also worn this outfit so many times i will say the green color is my favorite but this blue color for some reason is so stretchy so i will say if you're debating between the two colors this one is definitely a little bit stretchier we don't have any scrunch in the back anywhere on these. They're very just plain. We just have these subtle fleck details in there. And then it is a compressive ribbed waistband. And also in the Adapt family, we have the Adapt Camo, which is another one of my favorites. I actually recently just came out with this camo. Previously, the camo had been a very thick material, but they changed it to be more of a thinner, stretchier ribbed fabric. See if you can see the ribbed detail on there. But these are so much better now, especially the leggings. I actually just wore these for the first time last week, and I was blown away by these. They're just insanely stretchy, so soft, so flattering. If you're looking for a good legging to pick up in this sale, I think the camo should be at the top of your list. And like I said, I'm not a leggings girl, but these... I mean, look at this. And this color is just... So cute. Let me give you a little close-up. I did just wear these, so they are dirty. So that's probably why they look a little bit wrinkly. I'm not a big fan of the camo bras, but they did make a bandeau bra that is the same color as these leggings. And this set together is so freaking cute. I also have this little cropped tee that is very, very cute. I love this. It is a little bit longer in the back. You can see it kind of dips up in the front. Also wanted to point out that there isn't any scrunch details or anything on the camo either. All right, let's try them on. Since I've been wearing the green so much, I figured I'd start off with the blue. Like I was saying, this sports bra is just so flattering for the collarbones and the shoulders. The back is very simple. 
I am wearing a small in both of these and they fit very true to size. I think if you truly are in between, you could size up in these. I think I could comfortably wear a medium as well, but I like how compressive the smalls are. They are a little bit of a shorter short, but they're very flattering. And like I was saying, we have this pretty speckle. It's like a light blue speckle in this dark blue. I love it. And if you're not a fan of that sports bra, we have this very cute little cap sleeve tee. I love this. Again, I think it's so flattering. The shoulders, the collarbones. There isn't any pads in these, but it is pretty compressive. So I find I don't need a bra, but you could easily put one under this as well. And then also another option for this blue is the blue bandeau. The bandeau is just a solid blue, so I think it's a cute contrast with the flex on the shorts too. And I also wear a small in both of these as well. Oh yeah, I also want to point out that the back of this is just solid. Nothing fancy going on in the back. All right, let's put the camo on. Here is the camo shorts with the crop tee. I think this is such a cute outfit. I love how this is really short in the front so you can kind of see whatever sports bra you're wearing underneath. I'm wearing a medium in this crop top and I think it fits perfect. And then in these shorts, I'm wearing a small. I will say these shorts are a little bit on the tighter side. I do think I could wear a medium in these as well. The band on the leg is just squeezing me a little bit, so I feel like I could do a medium in these. I think this is such a cute leg day fit though. I do also have this camo in some more colors. Unfortunately, the pink doesn't come in shorts, but there is two more other shades of camo in the shorts. Oh, these are definitely my new favorite leggings. These and the Everyday Seamless are both so flattering and so stretchy. But if you're looking for a good legging to wear on a lower body day, these are the one. You need these leggings. Hopefully you can see the ribbed detail on these. So soft, so stretchy. These are actually a lot stretchier than the shorts. And look how freaking flattering. Oh, I'm obsessed. I'm wearing a small in both. All right, moving on to the Power Collection. These actually just recently dropped, so I just did a review on these in a previous video. But I am honestly shocked that these are not sold out. Like, I think these shorts are so slept on. These are one of my all-time favorites. Not only do we have the most gorgeous red, and Gymshark never does reds, but the details on these shorts are just so nice. We have the shorter front, longer in the back, we have these seams going down the front to really just like emphasize your quads. And then we do also have a very slight scrunch in the back that once it's on, you can't really tell. It stretches out very nicely and just, it's not one of those like aggressive butt scrunch, you know? Also have a red sports bra, which this probably looks weird hanging down, but this goes around your waist and it's just kind of like a strappy detail. I honestly just tuck this up into my sports bra. I don't really love the way it looks. You could honestly just like cut this off too. But I think this sports bra is so cute. I love the like GS details on this. And the back is very simple and cute. I really like the contrast with these two. Where we have the darker and the lighter red and then the solid shorts. And if this color is just a little bit too bold, too in your face, we do have it in a neutral color. This is kind of like a grayish green. I can't remember the exact name of this, but it is a very pretty color. Same exact style on the shorts with the seams and the scrunch. And then the sports bra is also the same style in this colorway. This red also looks really good with just like a black top. I feel like a red and black combo is just like, it's just so badass. And then I recently just got this zip up. I am obsessed with this. So it is just kind of a normal zip up in the front. But then in the back, we have that dip up. So you can kind of see a little bit of skin. And I just think that is so flattering. It's kind of funny, it's like the opposite of the shorts where they dip up in the front and are longer in the back. And then on the zip up, have the longer in the front and the dip in the back. And also these shorts do come in black as well. So if you wanted to pair that with the zip up, I think that would be really cute. I'm probably going to need to grab the black shorts on the sale. But let's try it on. Can we just take a moment for the color? 
This set is so bold and so badass. I am obsessed with the red. My all-time favorite thing about this fit though is how the shorts are shorter in the front and longer in the back. You don't have to pull them up your butt to like make it flattering because you have the little scrunch here and you also don't have to worry about them being too short either. I just think that these are so perfect. I wish more of the shorts had this feature. And then also these seams down the front here are so cute and flattering. And of course the sports bra. Love this design. Like I said, I tuck up this strappy detail, but this is what it looks like with it down. It's still, it's still actually very cute. I don't know, it's just a little bit much for me. I just, I like it to be a little bit simpler and tucked up. I'm wearing a small on both of these. I don't believe that this sports bra came with pads, but it does have a hole that you can put pads in it if you want them. Now for the jacket. Like, come on, this is so cute. And wait for it, boom. Oh, I love that so much. I think that is just the cutest, coolest feature. But it hits a very nice spot in the front, just like right on your waistline. I am obsessed with this. It's so like slimming as well. I do have to point out though that there is one thing I don't love about this jacket, and that is the thumb hole situation. I don't know why it looks like this. Like I feel like a lot of... Like, it really just sticks out, and I don't even think it looks good on the thumb. Like, I feel like it's just a really weird thumb hole. I don't know. But it is really easy to just tuck in the sleeve, and you can't even notice it. But yeah, that is my one bone to pick with this. But other than that, she's perfect. I hope that you can see it in this lighting, but there is also these really flattering and cute seams that kind of just, like, come down the side. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see it. I feel like that really helps too to just kind of like make it slim. Now on to one of my all-time favorites, my OG. We have the Legacy Collection. The Legacy Collection just has a special place in my heart. I really can't say a bad thing about these shorts. Stretchy, they're soft, they're compressive but not too tight, they're not too short, they're not too long. Like I just feel like this is probably my ultimate go-to short. We have the very flattering seams in the back that kind of dip down with the logo there. Of course, the no seam in the front. And these do have a little scrunch detail on the side that you can scrunch up or you can leave them down. Personally, I just leave them down most of the time. They just recently came out with some more neutral colors in this collection. Before we had the bright pinks and blues and greens and now we have neutral colors that just go with everything. This is probably one of my favorite colors from the latest drop. This colorway is called Walnut Mauve. You can really pair this with just any color and it looks so good. So highly recommend this one. And then we have this dark green color. And another one of my favorites, I feel like this is a very pretty like wintry color. This one is called Plum Brown. And the logo on this one is a very cute kind of like pinky purple. I don't know if that's showing up very well. But this color is also so pretty. And then of course we have it in black as well. One thing I thought was kind of interesting that they did with this collection is they didn't make the sports bras the exact color match. But they did match it to the logo on the back. So on the logo of the back of the shorts, it's like a light green. And then the sports bra is a light green. They have that little contrast that looks really cute together. And then with the plum brown, how I was saying, it's kind of that pinky logo. They did a pinky sports bra. Such a cute combo. And I don't have the black bra, but then they just did a black and white. The white bra is one of my favorites. I love this mesh detail over the top. You can just kind of barely see the logo through it. I just think this one looks so good on. Very simple back of the bra, just this one strap, and you can adjust the tightness of that. Alright, let's try it on. 
Like I was saying, I have absolutely nothing bad to say about the Legacy Collection. These shorts just fit perfectly. I really do think that these just have the perfect amount of compression, especially on days where you just don't feel like being like squeezed too tight around your leg or around your waist. These are so perfect. These really are just my absolute go-to. We have this just kind of like straight seam here and then the scrunch on the side that you can scrunch up. This is what it looks like scrunched up. It just kind of makes it a little bit higher on the side or you can wear it down with no scrunch is what I usually do. And then the back, very flattering seams in the back. I love this detail. These are just like very different from any other of the Gymshark collections. And then very simple back on this sports bra and this mesh layer in the front. There isn't any pads in this sports bra but I do feel like it hold you in really well, especially with this extra layer up top. I feel like this sports bra is like very, it's like not too showy, but like a little bit showy at the same time because you have this little keyhole. I just feel like it's very flattering and cute. And then the logo up here is pretty low key because of the mesh layer. I'm wearing a small in both of these and they are very true to size. I wouldn't say to size up or size down. Stick with your normal. I'm not going to try on the other colors because they do just fit the exact same and look the exact same. But I do think that this, this walnut mauve color is probably my top pick. Along with the green fit, just looks really good together. Alright, now we're on to the crossover collection. I feel like this is probably one of the most slept on collections. I... I never see anyone wearing these shorts, and these are one of my favorite shorts. The waistband has this little crossover detail, and it kind of V's down just slightly. So, so flattering on. I feel like it really just kind of, like, snatches your waist a little bit. And the material is very thin and stretchy and soft. And I do find all of these to be very squat proof as well. I feel like this collection is going to be on a really good sale. So make sure you look out for these ones. We have this kind of orangey color. This one is one of my new favorites. I just got these last week. And this green is gorgeous. I love this color so much. Of course we have them in a black. And then lastly I also just got this blue. So pretty. And if you've watched my previous haul videos then maybe you would remember... The flare leggings, these are also part of the crossover collection because they have that same waistband in the front. I can't wait to show you guys these on. They're so flattering. And they also made these in a tall and shorter and I believe a regular length as well. Or it might just be tall and regular. But I got the regular length. And then we have this pretty greenish... Oh, I can actually tell you the name. I haven't worn these yet. Darkest Teal. Love these. And then if you're getting the flared leggings, then you got to get the top to match. We have little crop tees. And in the back of the tee, they have that like cross detail that kind of like V's up your back just slightly. But this with the flared leggings is so cute. Let's try them on. Trust me when I say you need this set in your life. It's so comfy, so flattering. We have this like crossover waistband and then in the back of the t-shirt there is that like little cross as well. They're so flattering on the glutes. There is a seam in the back as well. This is that uh, like darkest teal color. Somehow I did end up with a tall in these so they are really long on me but but I don't really mind. Oh, I'm just in love with this. I'm wearing a small in both of these and they fit perfect. Even in the winter, a puffer over this. It's so cute. This has definitely got to be one of my top picks for you guys, like my top recommendations. I feel like you could wear this to the gym, but honestly, I just feel like this is the most perfect everyday outfit. You're going to school, you're running some errands, just going shopping. Perfect. Bruh. I am in love with this outfit. These have got to be probably just one of the comfiest shorts. If you don't like a very compressive short, then these are definitely the ones for you. They're so buttery soft, thin, stretchy. They don't squeeze your leg too tight or your waist. In fact, I will say if you do want a tighter fit, you could even size down in these. There is a little bit of like extra room in the waistband here. Personally, I like the way that these fit. I kind of like that they're not super tight. But they are also very flattering. I have a small in both of these. This one is the ruched 
training bra, I believe it's called. I do also want to show you guys this t-shirt with this because the greens match perfectly. These shirts are so soft. So you could wear this full length like this. I think this one actually looks really cute. But personally, I really like how these look tucked up. A lot of the girls were doing this in the shoot last week that we had. And I just think this looks so cute like this. These shirts are like insanely soft and comfortable. They are slightly a little bit higher on the neck. And then the shoulders are kind of a shorter one. But I think that really just shows off your arms and your shoulders. This is definitely a fave. I need to post this on my Instagram real quick. <laughs> okay, last few things until I move on to more comfy loungewear. I gotta start out with the Everyday Seamless. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, when I first tried these on like a couple months ago, I wasn't a fan. I thought they were too sheer and I just, th I just didn't think I would wear them. But when, but last week when I was in Houston with the girls, I tried on some of this stuff and I was like, wait a minute, I love these. They're insanely stretchy and they're just so flattering. I will say they are on the sheer side, but I actually find these two lighter colors to not be as sheer as the black and the navy. Or at least it's just like not as noticeable as those dark colors. So I got the green in these shorts. These definitely are on the shorter side, which you'll see when I put them on. But the detail, like the little contour detail on here is just so nice. Like I said, they're just so stinking flattering. I also have those in the leggings as well. These ones are so wrinkly because I took them out of the dirty clothes. But again, we have that really flattering contour. I just put these on my Instagram story the other day and I was like, y'all, these are probably the most flattering legging I've ever put on my body. These are definitely gonna be like my go-to bottoms, especially for upper body day. Don't get me wrong, I did legs in these the other day, but if you are worried about the sheerness, then wear these on upper body day because your booty will be looking juicy while you're doing shoulders and arms. I also had to get this cherub tee in white because in Houston I wore this with these bottoms and I fell in love. So I had to get this one too. I have the black one, I reviewed it in a previous video. But I'm in love with these tees. They have a very vintage look to them because the sleeves are so long. And I feel like when you kind of tuck this up, they just look really cute. So this is definitely one of my favorites. And then also the Cherub Joggers are a favorite. They have the little graphic. It's like down by your shin. But these are so cute. I actually have these ones in a medium. And I actually like the way the medium fits. Usually I would get a small, but these ones have a nice, like, oversized, comfy look. I actually really like wearing a baggy sweatpant on an upper body day as well. These are another thing I just recently fell in love with that I tried on in Houston last week. These tees are so cute. I, I slip on these. I'm not gonna lie. They're so soft, so stretchy. And these tucked up into your sports bra, they just look so badass. They have a little bit of a higher neck. They show off the shoulders good. And then I also got it in this green color as well. I wanted to grab the black one, but I believe the small sold out. But they do have the green in smalls. I know for sure I'm going to pit out in this, but I don't even care. Then I wanted to go over just a few of my favorite sports bras. I know I kind of talked about some of the bandos and minimal bras. But I also wanted to show you some more colors. We have this beautiful orange. Which Cranon wore this orange with this Everyday Seamless green color in this. This is a fit right here. And we have this light gray. Black and navy blue. This new brown color. And then I also grabbed this ruched bra. Alright, let's try it on. Have to start out with this fit because this is the one I fell in love with last week. The colors just match perfectly and I just, I love this tee. It is a little bit longer, it's like more waistband length, but I like it tucked up. I think that cropped look with the long sleeve is just so cute. These shorts are just so stretchy, so flattering. Like I was saying, these aren't going to be everyone's cup of tea. They are more on the sheer side. I feel like I would mostly wear these on like an upper body day. They also are on the shorter end for sure. The back is like just under 
my booty so just keep that in mind as well but if you're not a fan of the short short i'd say go with the legging because you still get the very flattering glutes i think i'm gonna throw on the leggings as well just so you can see how flattering they are in like legging version the leggings like come on look how flattering these are these will definitely shear out if you're doing like squats or deadlifts so I say wear these on like a shoulder or back day and then you'll have a juicy upper body and a juicy lower body. Also come in this really pretty kind of grayish purple color and then navy and black as well. Like I was saying though, the black and navy are like more, like the sheerness is way more obvious in those darker colors than it is in these two. I'm gonna throw on the cherub joggers too. It looks so cute, the all white set. We have the little detail on the shin here. I love this. This tee I have a medium and then also these joggers are a medium as well. They don't have a drawstring so usually I would get a small on these but I actually really like the way the medium is like really baggy. I also put on this orange minimal bra. I think this color combo is so cute. Shout out Cranon for the idea. But this is a fit right here. I can't believe I almost forgot to mention these mesh shorts. I am obsessed with these. These camo ones are probably my favorite. I think this looks really good with the orange too. These are in the men's section, but they look so good on the girlies. These ones I'm wearing are an extra small, and I think I really like how these fit because I don't have to roll them. Like, I think they're a nice length and, like, pretty tight around my waist, so I really like the extra small. But I do have a small that I'll try on for you as well. Here is the small. I feel like for these ones to, like, look better, I do need to roll them. And I kind of like not having to roll the extra small, so I think that's why I prefer those. But I do like these ones as well. They're like a little bit of a baggier look to these. I love the white as well. And then I also have the orange pair. I got these ones in an extra small. And then there is another pair that I believe are in Elijah's Dirty Clothes somewhere. But they have the Gymshark logo across the front. Definitely, definitely check those out. I'm definitely going to be ordering those in an extra small. Yeah, I'd say if you like the baggier rolled look, then probably go with the small or medium. But if you like to not have to roll them, then go with the extra small. Now on to some comfy, cozy vibes. Shark has been coming out with so many good rest day lounge outfits, so it was really hard to narrow this one down. But I gotta start out with this one. This is the baby pink, and it has I feel like in this lighting it is just not going to show up well, but it has white logo and then it also has a white logo across the booty. I will say though, this is probably my all-time favorite. This is the Rest Day Collection. This color has my heart. I am obsessed with this. We have the embroidered Gymshark logo on there. These are definitely more of a thicker, kind of heavier weight material. I got a large in the hoodie and small in the sweatpants. Sweatpants are very simple. We just have the scrunch at the bottom and then and then we do also have drawstrings in here as well. This one is a new release from Gymshark. This is part of the Loopback collection. The material is very similar to the rest day on these, but the fit is very different. This one is a slightly thicker material. We have the embroidered Gymshark on the side here. There is drawstrings in here. I don't know what it is about the little scrunch at the bottom as well. I just think that little scrunch is so stinking cute. We love good neutral sweat set. And then the hoodie is what really sets this apart from the rest day the fit of this is so different we have a little bit of a tighter band at the bottom and it is a little bit more cropped and then we have this really cute detail around the sleeve right here a little bit of a longer ribbed part around the wrist and we also have the embroidered Gymshark right in the center can't wait to show you guys that one on and then I had to pick one from the men's Honestly, the men's section, their sweat sets are popping off. Luckily, Lige has a ton of sweat sets, so I can steal his as well. But I did just get this one. This is a new release. It's part of the heavyweight collection for the men's. We have this half zip here, the Gymshark logo here, and I'm obsessed with this font. I just think that looks so cool, and I really like this color. It's like a light gray acid wash and in this one I got a large and then for the sweats we also have an acid wash going on this is a set but I will say the sweats do look slightly darker I have just the scrunched bottom here 
drawstrings and then there is a little pocket in the back let's try them on this is gonna be my top pick for you if you're looking for just like a very nice sweat set to wear all winter it's very thick and warm I'm wearing a large in this top and I actually thought that these were a small but these are an extra small so if you're wanting them to be a little bit baggier I would do a small. Definitely check out the other colors in this rest day collection as well because they have a really nice brown and gray and like a taupe color. So definitely check out the other colors. I do have to say I think the green is my favorite though. Here is the loop back set. Similar material but very different fit from the rest day. This band here is just a little bit more snug around your waist. So the hoodie isn't as slouchy as the rest day one. This is also a very nice like running errands, going to school. Like you look very comfy but you also look put together. I'm wearing a medium in the hoodie and a small in these joggers. Also want to point out that I feel like these joggers are longer than the rest day. So if you are a taller girly I feel like you would probably like these joggers better. I have a lot more room at the bottom of these joggers than I do with the rest day ones. Here is the men's set. I am so obsessed with this half zip. I love the way this fits. The waistband on the, or the band around the waist is actually a little bit tighter. So it kind of like is up here but then like hangs over which I think looks really cool. I'm wearing a large in this top and I got a medium in these sweats. And I will say the waistband, since these are men's, I got a medium because I knew Elijah would want to wear them too, but the waistband is huge. Like, <laughs> I definitely have to roll them and tighten this for them to stay up. But they do have a very comfy, loungy fit to them. To wrap up this video, I have to show you guys some accessories. New favorite gym bag, hands down. This is the cutest pink ever have the little Gymshark logo on there. The material of this is so nice. I don't think the camera is doing this color justice. It's so cute. You have a long strap that you can adjust with the pad up here and then it also has two shorter straps if you prefer that. The one big pocket that has a couple zippers and the slots inside of here and then there is also this front it's like a velcro pocket. Then we have the new mini gym bag. Is this not the cutest thing ever? If you're the type of person that only takes your keys, phone, wallet, whatever to the gym, then this is the bag for you. Even though this is like a mini gym bag, you can honestly fit so much in here. Like this could easily hold water bottle, phone, keys, wallet. This is like perfect. Since it's getting cold out, I'll usually always go to the gym in like sweats and a sweatshirt. So I feel like right now I kind of need the bigger gym bag so I can like put those in there. But in the summer, I literally just go to the gym with my water bottle and phone and keys. So this is going to be so nice. Wow, I love this thing. And everybody needs a good tote bag in their life. This one's actually kind of different because the top of it is like a cinch. You can like cinch up the top. And then, I'm obsessed with this like swishy material. It's such a good size too. It has like this little secret pocket in the back. And lastly, I couldn't not talk about this little guy. I say little, but it actually holds so much too. This is like, this is like my everyday purse type of bag from just like running errands, going shopping. And it's freaking adorable. The strap is adjustable so you can make this shorter or longer if you wanted it to be a little shorter or longer and wear it like a, a crossbody type. I love it! Oh. I love this material. It has the little like rubber patch on here. And the design on this is so cute. But I think that wraps up this video. I really hope I didn't forget anything. Like I said, with the whole site being on sale, it was so hard to decide what to put in this video, what to leave out. But if there's anything that you were wondering that I didn't talk about, I probably reviewed it in past videos. So make sure you check those out if you're looking for something else. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please comment if you have any questions. And again, the sale starts November 16th at 9 a.m. PST. So make sure you build that wish list so you're ready when the sale goes live. And don't forget to use code Allie at checkout to save you an extra 10% and support your girl. I love you guys. I'll see you next time.